Hello friends, my name is Ramasu. Today we shall discuss about topic the document term matrix. Friend, today's topic is very very interesting especially if you have interest in machine learning or artificial intelligence and you want to learn about it. So let's start friend. First of all I would request to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell option as well so that my new videos can reach to you and also you can follow me on the Facebook page as well. Basically friend in natural language processing we see many methods of representing text data. Term document matrix is also a method for representing the text data. In this method, the text data is represented in the form of a matrix. The rows of the matrix represents the sentences from the data which needs to be analyzed and the columns of the matrix represent the word. The dice under the matrix represent the number of occurrences of the words. Okay. So for example we take this document and from this document we make the matrix that matrix called as document term matrix now uh, let's underst understand with an example here just take it as an example there are three sentences in the document for example first is the I love football second is the Messi is a great football player and the third is the Messi has won seven balloons of hours okay so uh, these uh, these are the three sentences in the document from these three sentences we make the uh, document term matrix how we make this here we can see a set of text responses the term document matrix of these responses will look like this from this matrix we can get the total number of occurrences of any word in the whole corpse and by analyzing them we can reach many fruitful results. Term document matrix are one of the most common approaches which need to be followed during natural language processing and analyzing the text data. More formally we can say that it is the way to represent the relationship between words and sentences presented in the corpse. For example, this is the sentence I love football. Here I occurrences one time, love occurrences one time football is one time okay then messy zero and all other words are uh, you can say are zero why because the occurrence of that particular word here in the sentence is zero second sentence messy is a great football player here you can see the i love football football occurrence is one time why because here is football then messy occurrence is one time so in that way you can see uh, here is a sentence and here is the words and you can see the occurrences here in that so this is an example of document term matrix so friend thank you thanks a lot for uh, watching the video i hope you like this video if you like it please share it with the friends and colleagues and thanks a lot for watching the video